Good day, everybody. How are you all doing? This is Dr. Nandi. Today, we are going to talk about a problem on de Moivre's theorem, application of de Moivre's theorem. So I'll share my computer screen with you. So we'll first deal with the expression of one minus square root of three i to the power of 10. And this will be equal to square root of So uh, before I do that, uh, let me figure out what is a. So let's just deal with one minus square root of i. My a is equal to one, and my b is equal to minus square root of three. So a square plus b square is equal to one plus minus square root of three square is equal to one plus three is equal to four, okay? So square root of a square plus b square is equal to square root of four is equal to two. So I can write one minus square root of three i as two, then half minus square root of three by two i. Okay, now in this case, uh, we compare with the expression uh, r cosine theta plus uh, i sine theta. So my cosine theta is equal to half and my sine theta is equal to minus square root of three by two, okay? So, if I use TI-84 to find the angle theta is equal to cosine inverse half or theta is equal to sine inverse minus square root of three by two, okay? So, <clears throat> Let's get some space here. And let me get stuff. So my theta is equal to minus 60 degree by using my calculator. So this becomes equal to, so square uh, one minus square root of three i is equal to then two cosine si minus 60 plus i sine of minus 60. Okay, and now I will apply the de Moivre's theorem. One minus square root of three i exponent 10 is equal to two exponent 10 and then cosine of minus 60 times 10 plus i sine of minus 60 times 10, which is equal to two exponent 10 cosine of minus 600 degree 
plus I sine of minus 600 degree. Okay. Now you can go in your calculator using TI-84 and this will then simplify to 2 to the power of 10 cosine of minus so, Six hundred is uh, minus zero point five. Sorry, minus zero point. Let me erase this and write it again. So cosine minus 600 degree is equal to minus 0 0.5 plus sine of minus 600 degree is 0 0.866 i. Okay. So that is for this expression. Now we will be dealing with the second expression. So let me again create some space here. Okay. So the second expression is minus two as 2i, okay? So, which can be written as, uh, again here, uh, a is equal to minus 2 and b is equal to 2. So, a square plus b square is equal to, or is equal to uh, minus 2 square plus 2 square is equal to 4 plus 4 is equal to 8, okay? So, r, r is equal to square root of a square plus b square is equal to square root of 8, or this is uh, square root of 2 to the power of 3, which is equal to 2 to the power of 3 by 2. So, hence, we can write Mm. minus 2 plus 2i is equal to 2 to the power of 3 by 2 and then minus 2 divided by square root of 8 plus 2 divided by square root of 8i which is equal to 2 to the power of 3 by 2 minus 2 by square root of 8 is minus 1 square root of 2 plus 2 uh, plus uh, just uh, it should not be 2 so let me use this plus uh, <laughs> 1, this will be, this will be 1 square root of 2i, okay? So, this becomes equal to 2, this becomes equal to 2, uh, equal to 2, 3 by 2 exponent, and this is um, 
cosine, if you use your calculator to find inverse, cosine inverse minus one over square root of two, you'll find this is cosine of 135 degree plus I sine of 135 degree. 135 degree, okay? Now we'll be applying the de Moivre's theorem. So the expression calls for, so let me create some space again. Okay. So this is, uh, we have, uh, the actual expression was minus 2 plus 2i exponent is minus 6. And that is equal to, and then, by de Moivre's theorem, 2 to the power of 3 by 2, whole thing raised to the power of minus 6, and then cosine of minus 6 times 135 degree, plus I sine 30, 135, sine 6 minus 6 times 135 degree, by application of de Moivre's theorem. So, this is equal to 2 to the power of minus 18 over 2. And then <laughs> cosine of 6 times 135 minus 6 times 135 degree is 0 by calculator minus uh, uh, cosine uh, sine of one minus 6 times 135 degrees minus 1 i. So this becomes equal to 2 exponent minus 9 because 18 divided by 2 is minus 9 times minus i. Okay. So Now the entire expression, if I write here, was one minus square root of three pi exponent 10 multiplied by minus two plus two i exponent minus six. So this is equal to two to the power of 10 minus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.866 i for the first expression and then for the second expression it is minus 2 to the power of minus 9 times i so eventually this simplifies to 2 to the power of 10 minus 9 and this becomes <coughs> positive 0 0.5 because minus i multiplied by 0 0.5 is positive 0 0.5 i and then minus 0 0.866 times i square. Okay, now, okay, 0 0.866 i square. So let's move this screen a little bit on the top. So, okay, and let me go back to my pen. So, uh, we will get rid of, so I have to use my screen, my eraser actually, to get rid of these lines. And then going back. So we have zero point. Okay. Now we know I square is equal to minus one. So we know I square is equal to minus one. 
So this expression finally becomes two to the power of 0 0.5i plus 0 0.866, and which can be written as uh, as um, <clears throat> is equal to two zero point so cosine inverse zero point five plus uh, I sorry this is my mistake so i will have to erase this out so we will write this as 0 0.866 plus 0 0.5 I. So, 2 cosine inverse 0 0.866 plus sine inverse 0 0.5 times I, which, need uh, some space. So this is equal to then two cosine of or uh, cosine of thirty degree plus sine of thirty degree times i, right? Yeah. So that's your final answer. Cosine of 30 degree That's the answer. I'll stop here today. If you have any question or comment, please write me a note. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. And if you like this uh, what you this video, please give me a th thumbs up. I really appreciate that. And let your friends know about it. So yourself and your friends can subscribe to my channel by clicking on the sub red subscribe button at the bottom right corner. Thanks. Take care. Have a nice day. See you next time.